If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. One way to customize the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat Pro is to click the Add, Remove, or Reorder Tools button at the bottom of the Quick Tools panel, and then select the Customize Toolbar button from the side menu that appears. Alternatively, click the Hamburger Menu button, roll down to the View command, roll over the Show slash Hide command in the side menu that appears, and then click the Customize Toolbar command in the next side menu that appears. Doing either action then opens the Customize Toolbar window. You use the Customize Toolbar window in Acrobat Pro to customize the buttons that appear in the Quick Tools panel. At the left side of the window, a preview of the Quick Tools panel appears under the Toolbar section. The buttons you use to change the toolbar appear to its right. Finally, a list of command buttons you can add to the toolbar appears under the Choose Tools to Add section, grouped by category. You can click a category to expand and collapse it to show the individual buttons within the category. Note that you cannot remove or change the order of the default buttons that appear in the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat. To add a new button to the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat, click to select the button after which to add the new tool in the Quick Tools panel in the Toolbar section. This must be either the Sign Document button or later in the Toolbar. Then click to select the button or button group to add to the Toolbar after the selected button in the Choose Tools to Add section. To add all buttons within a button category, Click to expand the category and then do not select a specific button within the category. Alternatively, to add a specific button, click to select the button to add in the expanded category. After making your selection, then click the Add to Toolbar button between the two sections to add the selected buttons to the selected position in the toolbar. To add a divider line below a button in the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat, click to select the button after which to add the divider in the Quick Tools panel in the Toolbar section. This must be either the Sign Document button or later in the Toolbar. Then click the Add Divider to Toolbar button between the two sections. To change the location of a custom button or divider you added within the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat, Click to select the button or divider. Then click the Move Up or Move Down button between the two sections as needed. To delete a custom button or divider you added within the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat, click to select the button or divider. Then click the Remove from Toolbar button between the two sections. To save your changes to the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat, click the Save button at the bottom of the Customize Toolbar window. Alternatively, to cancel your changes, click the Cancel button and then click Yes in the Confirmation Prompt dialog box that then appears. After performing either action, the Customize Toolbar window then closes. If needed, to reset all changes to the Quick Tools panel in Acrobat after making customizations, click the Add, Remove, or Reorder Tools button at the bottom of the Quick Tools panel, and then select the Reset Toolbar button from the side menu that appears. Then, click the OK button in the Confirmation dialog box prompt that appears on screen to finish. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.